Remember when I did a video about King exposing that T.I. and Tiny family hustle was actually fake because he didn't even live in that house with them. He lived with his grandma. Yeah, man, it's a lot about that TV show, man, that got people confused because um, I live with my grandma. You know, we'll go. Now, a lot of y'all ate me up in the chat. However, there is nothing wrong with living with your grandparents. The problem is, is that they had a reality show selling that they were America's favorite family. But it just don't stop there because I was able to find an interview with Zanique Pullins, Tiny's oldest daughter, where she basically said her mom chose T.I. over her. Let's go ahead and get into it. <laughs> It wasn't so much about what Zanique said, it was about what was said and bleeped out that we couldn't even hear. Okay, what Okay, what hurt me? Why do you want to know if... I'm if, really curious now. Oh, because you want to know. Yeah, I'm curious oh, okay, now. Okay, yeah, okay. This is outside. Of, okay, I told, I told, I'm really going to beep it out for sure. Okay, so I would say what hurt me would be like... I'm Honestly, like my mom being like with Tip all the time. Damn. Like... Time stamp that. <laughs> that time I, got that, that, I feel I got like you. even even now and today, like that's how it is. Mm. Like they're just tied to the hip. But now I'm grown, so it's like I can't really give a. F but I get I. Can't. It's, it's just like. Zanique was on the J Hill podcast and she basically revealed something to him. Now, I respect J Hill because he did go ahead and bleep that out so we don't know exactly what she said, but we can kind of put two and two together. We can see that the relationship between T.I. and Tiny has really hurt her because like she said, Tiny was gone and when T.I. had to go somewhere, she would follow or vice versa. They were never really with the kids. And this seems like more than a one-off situation. This seems like a lot of times the kids were left with the grandparents and then T.I. and Tiny would go off and do their own thing. Damn, that's real. That's you feel thing. like... You could tell I'm sent to see. You feel like... Yeah, definitely. But also, it's like he don't want... He doesn't... But it's like they'd rather go places with each other. I said before we started the video, that wasn't me who bleeped that out. That was them. So we don't know what was said. But what I'm assuming is that it seemed she was applying that T.I. doesn't want to be bothered with her. She got to go. He go. It's just like. Damn. So. So that's what I'm saying as far as like. When I say. Listen, we, right. I'm about to tell you what you just unlocked, though. Like, oh, for real. Right, right. As safe as you're trying to be, this helped me. Like, so I met my stepdaughter at eight. Okay. I'm the same way. I want my, my girl to be everywhere with me. I didn't even take into account how that might make her feel. All right. See, and that's See why. how you help it? Okay, okay. So my parents aren't famous or, you know, anybody that you guys would know. But I do come from a two-parent household, and I do have a stepmom. So with my stepmom situation, it wasn't a thing where like there was any kind of jealousy or any kind of issues or anything like that. I was kind of young when I got a stepmom. So, I mean, she's basically is my mom or uh, addition to uh, being a second mother. For Zanique, it might be a little different because T.I. and Tiny, they have their own kids where with me, I just have me and my stepsister. So we are around the same age. So it kind of worked out perfectly. But I don't know how it would be if my parents did decide to have more kids. And if I would feel like some kind of jealousy or resentment that they love those kids more than they love me. But I can't say that to the world. I can say that to y'all. But that guy. Not that I really know y'all like that. But know that, you like that, Pyron. But that boy. guy, but even <laughs> but but like, the fact that you're saying, like, I can't say that to the. That got to hurt, though. Not really. No? No, because I don't have to express my feelings to, like, be, like, happy or. It won't fix me to tell people that. So that don't make you feel a little better, better getting it off your chest? Let me see. I don't know. I think it is kind of a different feeling. <laughs> Not really, though. Because I, <laughs> I don't know y'all like that. Like, I honestly, in my in the back of my head, I'm thinking, who they gonna run off and tell? Who did, like, I don't know. It's not oh. like I'm gonna talk to y'all tomorrow and next week and 
for a month and we gonna check out. I will say this. I hope Zonique does go ahead and get therapy, you know, and, and I don't think family therapy or anything like that. I just think for herself because whatever healing that she needs to go through or she needs, please go ahead and seek help. I will always be an advocate for talking to a therapist or talking to whoever you have to to get the healing that you need emotionally, you know? But I do want to point out that it's very interesting that there is a pattern with T.I. and Tiny not really being involved with their kids. And I know I got some hate because I said T.I. and Tiny weren't really that relevant throughout all the years of their children's lives. But I mean, that's my opinion and that's how I felt. I felt like they were stationed home enough to go ahead and provide for them emotionally. Obviously they did financially, but not really emotionally. T.I. and Tiny, of course, separately, not all together, they have a lot of kids. So you would expect one of them to be home with the kids or at least be involved in their lives. And again, their reality show was based on family, and now we're finding out that <laughs> T.I. and Tiny weren't even there. So the show was definitely fake. However, let me know what you guys think in the comments, and also, let me know if you guys would like a video on T.I.'s daughter, Deja, as well, because I know there's a lot of controversy a few years ago, especially with that whole virginity check thing, but we'll get into that later. Deuces, everybody.